Hi guys, Dean Newland, CEO and founder of Mission Facilitators, where for 30 years we've helped leaders, teams, and their organizations grow their people, clarify their visions, and implement their plans. We all know it, we all feel it, but what are the effects a toxic leader has on their team? Well, serious damage to our mental health, for one, constant criticism, belittlement, and unrealistic expectations create an environment of fear and anxiety, and we all should feel valued, not constantly on edge. They break down in teamwork and collaboration. Toxic leaders promote a cutthroat environment where everyone is pitted against each other. Trust and cooperation suffer, hindering productivity and innovation. Toxic leaders also stifle creativity and demotivate their team members. It's hard to feel inspired when our ideas are dismissed. Resilience and work-life balance also suffer. Constant negativity and conflict takes a toll on our happiness. So before you try and change your toxic leader, be the example you want in others and ask yourselves the hard question, what am I doing or allowing that is causing a toxic work environment? And what can I do every day to bring more positivity, empathy, collaboration, and teamwork to work?